to another video, guys. We're here at Bergen County Harley Davidson. Late night review Let's tonight, go. right after the bike night. Kill real success. Real successful bike night, I gotta say. So, you guys did your thing. There were a lot of bikes here. Had the live band, had some barbecue, had the beer truck. We had a ton of stuff here. So, so I had, guy. Guy we had guy. Um, a bunch of vendors. So, good you, turnout. You guys definitely, killed definitely killed it tonight. Awesome. But yeah, we, uh, we were supposed to list tomorrow morning, but Sergio was like, you know what? It's here. It's here now. We're here. Let's just knock it out tonight. I'm like, whatever. Let's and as we said that, he left, got his <laughs> camera, $500 deposit went down. Guy's coming back tomorrow. Yeah. So you can see it now 807 of 1000, and then she's gone. But this is 807. Yes, sir. All right, so <clears throat> obviously, here, guys, we have the brand new 2023 Harley Davidson Icon Highway King. Like you said, this is number 807 of 1000. This bike came out in two colors, so we got the High Five Orange and the Magenta, which is like a purple. In the videos and the pictures are Harley Davidson posted, it looks reddish, it but it's, it's really purple, guys. Um, but that one's gonna be limited to 750 only, but you guys are getting one. We have one sold. There is rumor Harley might be giving us a second one. So, if you are interested, let me know. Maybe we'll get you on it, we'll take a deposit. If it comes in, it's yours. <laughs> I really like the High Five Orange. I, when I first saw the magenta, I thought it was really like a reddish pinkish color and I really liked it. Uh, but it's more like a purple, like I said. It is really nice. I, I don't know which color I like better. Um, but let's just talk about the Icons edition real quick, guys. This is the third Icon that Harley Davidson has released. So obviously we first uh, saw that blue and white one that's very similar to this, uh, which was the Icon Revival, which came with like the original Street Lad fairing which later on became the street light. Um, then number two was the El Diablo, that was number two. And then number three now we have the Highway King. Beautiful, beautiful job here. I really like what Harley Davidson is doing with the Icons edition. For those of you guys who don't know what the Icon is, it's basically what Harley Davidson is doing is going into their archives, taking something out from the back. So this is from the 60s, 65, 68, 67 around there. I don't know the, the exact year, but late 60s, this is what this bike is taken after. Um, and it's, they're basically taking something from the past, drizzling some modern on top of it, and giving us, you know, a, a, a taste of the past, which is, which is pretty awesome. So this bike back in the day came with a similar seat like this. The older seat might have been smaller or bigger. Um, it came with these kind of same exact bags. We have the uh, the retrofitting shield in the front, which I love the fact that it's not all clear. I like the fact that it's tinted. Um, so on this one, you're gonna have the orange tint. On the magenta, you're gonna have the purplish red, whatever you wanna call it, magenta tint on it. Um, and it's really cool. I like the white wheels on it. Um, I, I like the two-tone. I know some yeah. people don't like the two-tone with the bags being a different color, uh, different from the, the actual paint on the bike, but I think it just throws it off and makes it look cool. It makes it look different. Um, the matte black accent though, I think they killed it. You know what, I, I love it. At first I was like, why did they do that? But now that I see it in person, yeah. I'm like, I, I like it. And I if really you think like it. back too, so when the breakout came out, the matte black breakout is that matte black, and then the orange kind of has this tint to it. So I feel like <laughs> it was in the making. Right on. For sure. Um, fun fact as well, so I know we got the high fire orange and the magenta, these were the actual colors that were released those years back in the 60s. So yep. th these are colors from back in the day. So it's, it's stuff like that is pretty cool. So I think, you know, Harley Davidson is making these bikes feel special. I know sometimes it's like, all right, well, they keep coming out with these numbered bikes, but what makes them so special? But stuff like this, where it's like taken off in the past um, and just drizzled with a, a bunch of futuristic, not futuristic, but just a, a modern taste to it yeah. is really cool. Um, I'll take a I'll take a seat on it. Can I take a seat on it? Yeah, man. I mean, the bike is pretty much sold already. I talked to him. I told him we're doing this. So, he's cool with it. <laughs> so he actually has Icon's first bike. He has the Diablo, and he is adding. And he has the revival too. He does. Wow. So he's adding this to his collection, and he is a really good friend of ours, and we are really excited that awesome. one of our hometown guys is coming for it. That's awesome, man. Yeah. So this is really cool. I mean, I'm looking down at the dash right now. I see number 807 of 1000. I see Highway King right there. I got the Icons collection logo right down there. It makes it look special. It makes it look pretty cool. Um, taller suspension, obviously. So this is suspension you're gonna have on the Road King. So it is pretty taller than, uh, than the actual suspension on your baggers, For to sure. be honest. 
Um, yeah, so, but you're not even flat footed. Yeah, I'm tippy toe on this bike yeah, right now, for man. Sure. So you're gonna have the four boards on there, which look really nice. They look really retro. Um, they, they don't have that modern look to them really much. They look really retro. Um, they're really sticky as well, real rubbery. That looks really good. I love the windshield, the big windshield in the front. Say whatever you gotta say about these big, uh, big windshields, but it looks really cool. It's gonna stop with that wind, uh, especially for those guys who are gonna hit the road on these for many, many miles, which I don't know. These type of number bikes, guys who tend to buy these bikes are not gonna be hitting that many miles on these type of things because you wanna keep the mileage low, you wanna keep the bike special, um, keep that resale value up um, from 20, 30 years from now. Who, Literally. Who, who, who knows, man? Who knows? Reminds me of like Memphis Shields a little bit with all the color. Memphis Shades? Yeah, Shades. And yeah. yeah. For sure. Yeah, but Memphis Shades had, the, the, does... Uh, Harley doesn't have any color, but this two-tone yeah. actually is a, is a smart idea. I like the C2, man. I really do. This is definitely a bike that, you know, if you look back and you see like, uh, like um, Elvis Presley. Yeah. He rode like Literally. these type of bikes. Like, you, you think about something like that, it's like, alright, this is like an Elvis bike. Yeah. This Turn bike it on. What does it look like? Interesting. I would have thought there was an LED in it. There's no LEDs? Is that, it's just a halogen? Just a halogen. You're lying. Harley, really? A halogen light, bro? Because it's back from the 60s, bro. <laughs> oh, okay. They couldn't make it too modern. I, I got it. I but got yeah, it. I could have sworn it. it was going to have an LED. How about the passive lights? Are they on or off right there? Now, yeah, you got to flip it. Boom. Okay. Old. No. <laughs> <laughs> I like the passing lights, man. I like it, yeah. It's a nice, it's a nice look. Now, one, one thing I was looking at right now, I'm like, okay, pretty cool. It's an icon bike, it's very special. Harley, why in the world did you guys not chrome out the whole front end? Like, oh, why? Yeah. Like, it's a, it's a, it's a, this, is a, this, this is a special bike. Chrome out the front end. <laughs> chrome it out. Like, it, it would have just made the bike look a bit more prettier. Um, but besides that, it's a gorgeous bike. It's beautiful. It's an icon. It's a collectible, and it's it's uh, it's beautiful. It is. It really, really is. Let's talk about price point real quick. Not bad, actually. Twenty-seven nine nine nine. Twenty-seven. Yeah. I gotta be honest, because I mean, when these first released, I thought that they were like a little pricey, mm -hmm. but that's just me. I don't know. Think about it, though. We are a dealer. How much is that rookie? Um, that those are special. up there. I want to say they're up in the 28s now. Right. So it, I don't think it's. Yeah, so I, I guess you when compare it to Road King, it's like, King, okay. The, um, it's not that bad, I guess. I, you know, there's dealers that are charging 2, 5, 10 over MSRP on these. So that's crazy. Because, okay. like, down in Florida, they'll get it. But yeah, yeah. I think that they, I think they priced it pretty well. You're getting a lot of bang for your buck. You're getting the 114 engine, you know. So. I think it's definitely worth it. Pretty awesome. Don't worry, Phil, come in. <laughs> Enjoy the fun, man. So it does have the 114, which is pretty awesome. Um, th that's one thing that the Icons Edition, it, you're, you're not gonna find big, big numbers on there. So if you do wanna get something bigger, we do have something special back of here as well, which is the Fast Johnny. That comes with the 117 as well. So that's more performance driven for you guys, as opposed to having an Icon, which is more more subtle more special more of a classic type of bike which this was a major surprise because we got our fast johnny's already this is actually and this came out of nowhere yeah so today they received two low rider, low rider ST, ST fast johnny's fast johnny's and they and both the left line. they both left within an hour yeah <laughs> so you guys already got rid of a, a street glide a road glide this is your second street glide so that's three yep plus two fast johnny's that's five and i think we're done i don't think they're going to give us any more <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys will solve But lowrider STs, if someone is interested, they can place an order for it, which is nice. Yeah, that, that's pretty cool. This is pretty cool. So look, we, we got the Highway King here. Boom. We got the Fast Johnny here. Did you see that? And then we got the 120th anniversary road glide right there. So it's like this little triangular circle. The like triangular circle is like weird. 163 of 1600 on the anniversary road glide. That's a pretty low number. Pretty low number, 163. What is? Pretty cool. So if you guys are in the local area, stop at Burger and Harley Davidson. We do have some special stuff here. Um, the seventh, the seventh. Are you guys going to be doing like a little thing here for the the, the preview of the yeah, CVOs? Yeah. So the CVOs are launching. Um, we are all going to get the same information at the same time. We have a bunch of deposits already, so we are excited. 
Um, I don't know if you've seen the videos that Harley dropped. There is some really cool stuff. I saw some yeah. Apple CarPlay in there. I saw some really cool features. So we're excited. Um, usually when that drops, we are pretty close in line for them to be delivered within that week or so. So that'd be awesome. We'll do videos. One, one of my buddies actually sure. came in. Yes. Up the closet with my, my um, boy's coming in. He's excited. He's ready. So when he gets it, I, you're going to get a full on review. He already told me, he's like, listen, dude, you're going to ride the bike. You're going to do the review. You're going to do everything. Just you're going to do everything. So you're going to get some good content. And the two bikes that are allocated to us, they're both my customers right now. So we'll have the road glide with your boy. And then the other guy that's buying the street glide from me is my boy. So All right, we right. might be able to be like, dude, let's take both of them. Maybe we can both ride. Never Ooh. know. Ooh. What? If we get their approvals, I'm in. <laughs> this is awesome, man. Yeah. Let's uh, open this up. Oh, okay. So it's just your normal bag. Yep. Pretty awesome. All right, guys, like I said, uh, thanks for watching. If you are in the local area, stop by Bergen Harley Davidson. Ask to speak to Sergio. Boom. That's my main guy right there. The guy Boom. with the 120th anniversary t shirt. Yeah. Made for you. A ton of bikes, guys. And there, there's road glides, there's street glides, there's road kings, there's low rider S's, STs, fat we, boys, yeah. there's Pan Americas, there's Sportsters, there's Nicesters. We have it all. And we are fortunate enough to say that we have an S Lowrider ST in black and white and sand. The only dealer in the area right now that has one of each left. The white was supposed to be mine. Yeah. One day. We'll get there because the black's supposed to be mine. <laughs> I guess I'll, I'll wait till 2024 to see what color I come on next. Never know. Maybe it'll be the first one with the first random new color that Harley Davidson come out with. Or another red. Or two tone. Anyways, like always guys, let the force be with you, ride safe, and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace!